Let's talk about the disruptions that have been happening for the last few days say, in Parliament. It's clear that your parties and every party part of the India Alliance wants one issue to be discussed, Manipur. But is that really counterproductive right now? Because the BJP has said, look, the Prime Minister is not going to speak. And as a result of that, they're going about business as usual. They're passing their bills because they have the numbers in Lok Sabha. And so is the opposition's protest right now going unheard? What message is the BJP trying to send the people of Manipur? That they are issues which are far more important. There are bills which are far more important than what has happened to the women. There are issues which are far more important to the complete breakdown in the relationship between the cookies and metes and naga. What is more important than talking about this conflict which is spreading to other parts of the Northeast and Assam, Mizoram? These are states on our border. This is becoming an issue of national security and territorial integrity. And yet the BJP feel that they have other issues of more importance. The Prime Minister, instead of talking about Manipur, is talking about Chhattisgarh and East India Company. I mean, in the past, I have never seen a Prime Minister who's been so indifferent. All political parties, uh, you know, of when they were Prime Ministers who faced a conflict, used to address the issue heads on. But in this particular case, I found a Prime Minister who takes credit for successes. But when it is, there's a failure, he outsources them to his cabinet. He has the time to campaign in a Delhi MCD election, but does not have the time to visit Manipur and console the victims of violence. As a citizen of India, as someone from the Northeast, I am shocked. I feel abandoned. I feel isolated. I feel a sense of disconnect. And this so is a feeling that is shared Gaurav by many Gaurav, in the Northeast. Based on what you're saying, are you making a case here for all bills, all legislations, all discussions to be put on hold and the focus to only be on Manipur in Parliament right now in this session? Absolutely. It's right now, it's a time to send a message of comfort to, okay. to try make an effort to heal the wounds. The, the, the fractions which have erupted in the communities will take decades to heal and they still have access to sophisticated weapons. These are states on our border and they are prone to external influences. Do we want the situation to worsen? Sur surprisingly, a party that champions itself on nationalism and domestic security is failing to, to preserve the integrity of the mm -hmm. Northeast, is failing on law and order is failing on domestic security, is failing the tribals, is failing the women. There is still time. There's still time for the Prime Minister to make a statement. And we hope that through okay. this vote of no confidence, he will have the courage to stand the inside BJP. Parliament and speak to the people of the nation.